Hi, I'm Rachel, a mom of three kids, Alex, Richie, and Ethan. We decided to leave our home country in the USA to travel the world, starting in Chiang Mai, Thailand. Join us on our fun, crazy, and average everyday lives while we journey around the world. Travel Cat Family. Hi everybody, today is laundry day, so we're gonna show you how we do laundry here in Chiang Mai, Thailand. Thank goodness it's like down the alley and around the corner from our apartment, and so it's easy to get to. There's no dryers anywhere here in Chiang Mai. I mean, I haven't seen a dryer, you know, anywhere in any laundry mat. Um, so the options for doing laundry in Thailand that I know of are you can wash it at home yourself and dry it, you know, put it out to dry. You can come to a laundry mat and um, use the washing machines and then take it home and hang them out. Or you can pay someone to come pick up your laundry and take it and then 24 hours later bring it back to you. We decided to do it ourselves because it saves money and um, it, the laundry mat, like I said, is down the street and around the corner. So I'll show you how we do our laundry. Okay, the kids are already starting to get the laundry put together. Alex is such a big help. <laughs> Hi, Alex. Sometimes she likes to do laundry on her own. Like, um, I would be like, okay, I'll come and help you do laundry. And then she's like, no, mom, I'll just do it myself because it's easier and quicker just to get it done, you know, without the boys there. And she says I'm in the way too sometimes. <laughs> but um, yeah, so this is where, where we do laundry at. The cute little laundry mat. It's got a lot of washing machines. Wish there was a dryer here. Okay, so um, the laundry is washing right now. So we typically leave our laundry in the washing, you know, we just leave it. We don't stay in there and wait around. So now we're gonna go to the fruit stand. I would like some fruit. I already had oatmeal this morning for breakfast um, because it was getting too late um, to wait to eat out. So um, I ate some oatmeal and now I need to go get some fruit from the fruit stand. I really want fruit. And then after I get my fruit, I'm gonna take the boys and Alex to go eat somewhere. Little restaurant right by our house. It's pretty cute. We've been here before. Um, it would be, well here's, this is generally what it's called. It doesn't have weird things in it actually. It's just like Does it have those weird roots that taste like fingernail polish remover? No, that's usually oh. a Tom Oh, okay. Yeah. Do you know what you're gonna get, Ethan? You're really sweaty. Okay. And I'm going to get a smoothie. So I got a banana and pineapple smoothie. And it, I'm going to taste it and see what it tastes like. It's really, really good. Wow. Here's the fruit that I wanted. <laughs> they didn't have a fruit stall open, but I got my fruit anyway in a drink. Okay, so Alex got the spring rolls, and that looks so beautiful. Look at that. They put a little flower on it. So pretty. Okay, so I ordered um, mango and sticky rice, but they're out of rice right now. So I just got the mango, which is fine, because I don't really need rice anyways. <laughs> Trying to cut down on, on that type of thing anyway. But is that good, Ethan? Yeah? The ice cream is good with vanilla. You don't like the smell? It smells good. Can you smell? That's real. It smells floral. <laughs> I can smell it. I like it. You can put it behind your ear. See? <laughs> what do you look, Richie? <laughs> Teen Titan with a flower. <laughs> a Teen Titan. Yeah, Teen Titan haircut with a flower. What? What? Attack on Titan. Wait, what is it called? Attack on Titans. Oh, I mean Attack on Titans. Oh God. Attack on God Titans. forbid I say it wrong. Not attack on Titans. I meant Attack on it's Titan. Singular, not plural. I meant Attack on Titan. I don't watch it that much. I haven't seen it in a long time. We're waiting for the second season. The second season. Yeah. yeah. 
but the second season only comes out in Japanese later this year, and then I think the English version will come out at the beginning of next it's year. It's been so long that I forgot the name for a second. Okay, so I put the flower in my ear, or not in my ear, but above my ear. It's too sweet, but That's kind of cool. Makes me want to go to Hawaii. <laughs> Hawaii. <laughs> Hawaii. We're doing something. And he's killing, he's killing his rice bear. What are you doing to your bear? Doing surgery. Oh, he said he's doing surgery. <laughs> are you a bear doctor? No. A rice doctor? Killer doctor. Huh? A killer doctor. A killer doctor? Okay, he says he's a killer doctor. It's a bed Look at that yummy, you, yummy get it on your yellow spoon. curry chicken. And then, and then no, no, don't do the soup yet. You get some rice on your spoon, like the leg, the leg of the bear. And then, That's an interesting rice. spoon, huh? Yep. It is a rice spoon. Oh, I thought this was real. Is that good? Okay, so we're back at the laundry place. It's probably been done for a while. So let's get it. Remember? Yeah, I know. I was gonna get it. I'll grab the soap. Ethan, we're gonna walk home. We're not taking a song towel right around the corner. <laughs> Here's our package. Awesome. Oh my gosh, it lit. I'm gonna have to make it dirty. I can't wash it. From Why? the sticker, it's still there. The circle. Uh, they should have gave you a brand new hat. I mean, they don't do that. They, you have, they, no, they should have gave you a brand new hat. So I'll have to like throw dirt in that patch right there so it'll not. Not right now. You don't have to. You should have kept the sticker on it. Okay, so basically what we're just going to do is we're going to take all the clothes out and put it in that bag and then walk it home. Okay, so here's the clothes on the clothesline up on the 14th floor of our apartment building. And some already flew off the line a little bit onto the ground, but we put it back on. And that's how we do laundry in Chiang Mai, Thailand. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video.